This is a weird ass segue, all right? Weird segue. Okay. Have y'all ever heard about being pegged? No, get the fuck out of here with that shit, bro. That's something real? Okay, so you know about that. So you know about that? It, is it what I I've never heard about this shit until like two days ago. Listen, I've had, I, I, there was this girl. I, I heard about this shit two days ago, my nigga. I, I, two days ago, I heard about there, this. There's this girl I chatted up with. I'm not going to mention names because I mean her decided we're going to keep this between us. So that's why I'm not going to mention her name. But me and her did My nigga has been pegged. No, nigga, I have not, bro. Don't you ever do <laughs> <she's laughs> <pegged. laughs> Don't you ever do she's pegged. Do you know what we're talking about? I, I think I, I know okay. what else she, let, let him finish it. Let she him finish told it. me, because I was like, what's the most freakiest shit you've ever done? Like, she asked me, I said, I had sex in a cemetery one time. So she's stopped judging me. That's, that's the dark. sexiest? That's sexiest? Uh, no, the freakiest shit that we That's freaky. I said I had sex in a cemetery. That does not sound freaky at all. That don't sound freaky. Sounds that freaky. sounds scary. Uh, uh, so, stop judging me. So she looked, you did? So, okay, go, go ahead. Go continue. She, then she said, well, I pegged a dude before. I said, you did what? Mm-hmm. She said, I pegged a dude. I said, what do you mean pegged? She said, a dude found my strap on and he said he wanted to feel what it was like. And I strapped it on and I pegged him. Is I that like, what you thought it was? Okay. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> and then she looked at me and, I, and, and I, I told her over the phone, look, I, you cool? Don't you ever in your life ever expect that out of me. Well. I, I'm Okay, go ahead. Because I, I feel like you got something to say. That's crazy. I don't. Look into the camera. We look into the camera. We 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 tell her to please look deep into the camera. Hey, hey, we gonna give her a solo right now. Go ahead, get get your shit off. Have you pegged? <laughs> Wait, uh, uh, I, I want. Hey, tell 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 the camera. I want I want to talk right into that motherfucker. I want you to break uh-huh. this shit down because I just learned about this shit. I do not understand it, and I I feel like this is something that is that is like dangerously normal. It it's is. more normal than y'all think it is. Okay, go ahead. Get your shit off. Um, no, no, no. I'm not trying to say that this is no, like no. an you, everyday... No, no. You don't have to say anybody's name, but just tell me the situation. It, it, right. It's happened quite a few times. <laughs> um, I think it might have been a fetish or something. I don't know. But it's happened to a couple different people. Different people? Mm. Yeah. Get, okay. How do we get to that point of being That's what I'm like, like give, I give me to understand how this came um, up. You, we had that talk about like, being, when y'all smashing and you like touched his butt. And I like kind of, I kind of turn to like, I, I, I get dominant, you know. I, I, I get like, but some, I, I've had it to where it's their idea. And I have had it to where it's my idea. I, I so somebody would say, yo, you need to put that thing up in there. Mm-hmm. I've had. <laughs> Woo! I can feel the judging in the room. I'm mm-hmm. not judging at all. I'm, I'm not judging, judging you. 100. Mm-hmm. I'm, 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 I'm not judging you. I'm saying okay. I'm so you at all? Let, let, let me back it up a little bit. So a couple days ago, I'm I'm looking through TikTok and I thought you were gonna say something else. <laughs> You're about to say a couple days ago. Then <laughs> you say I let thought you were gonna say something. Let different. your free flag fly. <laughs> So a couple days ago, I'm on TikTok. I don't know what the fuck y'all was talking about just now either. <laughs> I don't know where y'all was going with that. I, I'm on TikTok and I see this dude, these dude, white, three white dudes. They sit with a doctor and they go, they go, fam, why is it that all our all our nerves to help us come, whatever, whatever, are in the anal cavity? And I was like, what? they are. What? Now see, I, I didn't know that. And, and I go, what the fuck? He said, yeah, man, it feels so good. And I was like, hey, yo. How the hey, fuck hey, do you know what that feels hey, like? Yo. Cause I, I'm like, if it's in the cavity, then my nigga, what you got going in there to, to have you feel? He's like, it feels so good when you come, and I was like, wait, what? And so literally, I, I found another is, is a podcast. They're doing a lot of detector tests, and the dude and the dude says, do you like to get pegged? And once again, I don't even know what that shit is yet. And he goes, no. And the lot of detector said he's lying. He loves to get pegged. <laughs> And I'm like, wait a minute, what is getting pegged? And then after that, I'm like, I I, I want to know, but I don't want to know. And then uh, I, I was talking to my, my friend upstairs, and she goes, oh, yeah, dudes like to get pegged, blah, blah, blah. And she said it, it's called pegged because it's a straight dude that likes it when uh, when the girl puts some strap, strap on. Because if it was a dude doing it, it'd be gay. But I'm, I'm just like... Yo, what the fuck is going on? Like, we're so we in a society now where dudes 
like to get dicked down th th theoretically through the females by the females, yeah. but it's still something going in your ass though. I mean, but here's the thing though, because you can't be you can't be a hypocrite about the situation because then there's females that are like I'm lesbian. But then only fuck with girls who look like men and just wear strap on. To me, it's the same. What, what, it's the, the same thing because you gotta. You gotta. So you want somebody put something in your ass, man? No. No, right. no, no, no. Hear me out. No, hear me out. Bro. I'm saying to me, I, I see what he's saying because if you're lesbian, but y'all still have the dildo <laughs> going there, right? Mm -hmm. It's still the feeling of a penetration. Dick going, it's still a dick going inside, right? Facts. So to me, it's like, yo, fam. I know you like when the girl does it with strap on, but fam, you like dick in your ass. You like dick in there, fam. Um, they might. I don't like, know. They might. If, I don't think that far too. If so old girl like backed up and a dude got right behind her and smashed, he wouldn't even know. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Turn the lights off and get up behind him? <laughs> you, you, uh, fam, I, I, I'm going to tell you, that shit made me feel so weird. It made me feel so weird, right? Because I used to have a phobia. Um, uh, uh, of being taken advantage of in the military, right? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. So in the military, if you go to sleep, right? This is crazy about the military. Before, before you can let people who were, who were openly gay and people who were, you know, transsexuals in the military, they it used to be like, hey, nobody's gay, cool, right? Theoretically. So if you fell asleep at somebody's crib or at somebody's party, you wake up and it'd be like, it'd be everybody had a dick on your forehead. And they take a picture Man, of it. Dude. Oh, they'll take a picture of it. Especially if you're in an airborne unit. It'll, tell me, it'll be just all over your forehead. Slow. And they'll take a picture of it. Slow. And that shit, would, to them, it wasn't gay. It was like, yo, we boys. Yeah, real mix. You That's know what I'm saying? Um, Outside. 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 It was early. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? It was like, it, it was like this. on the forehead. Pure, pure testosterone, right? <laughs> so for me, I always had this thing like, Fam, when I get drunk, I get lit. Like, crazy okay. lit. While I pass the fuck out, don't know what happened. And I always had this fear of me waking up and a nigga then just took my fucking drawers off and beat my shit down. Because, because they know, I don't, I don't react to anything, fam. Like, I, I've had TVs fall on my head when I was asleep. And I woke up later like, man, what happened? God damn, I bleed. What the fuck? I thought he was going to wake up. Didn't this know strong. nothing. <laughs> Didn't know nothing and just wake up and like nigga my draws down. No, what the fuck my ass uh, hurt. So me. I always had a fear about that. So come to find out, niggas like this shit. And I'ma tell you, if if it's a few people admitting it, that means a great amount of people like being pegged. More than and you that think. shit is scary to me. Does that not mean they're gay though? No. So that don't mean they're not just, Y'all might think so, and people might. No, think no, no. So. I, I, for one, I, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't my, it ain't me for me to judge. It just threw me off. Hold on, what was that? But, Hour and four. So I, I think what I'm gonna do, cause we still got some more juice talking about. I'm, I think what I'm, I'm gonna just once it hits the thing, I'm gonna stop it, and I'm gonna put it on the computer, and then stop, um, stop that one too, and I'm gonna hit record, re-record. Okay. So that we get a little bit more content. And he's loving this, ain't he? He's, he's not because that, that shit. I was like, wait, what? And and the dude was like freaked out when they said it. But everybody in the room when he said, oh, you like getting pegged. It was like a normal conversation. <clears throat> and I don't understand what the what is going on in real life right now. They say that's where your G spots at. Right, but there so there's no other way to get it, huh? You you have you have to put a dick down in there. To get it don't it. Why, why gotta be a dick? Cause it's a dildo. I mean, it's a dick. <laughs> it's a literally a dildo. A, I mean, you don't gotta, you ain't gotta look at it like that though. I mean, how, how can I not look, look at, at it? Like I don't the know. I'm not the dick. man in this situation. I'm asking you, balls. how can I not look at something that's the shape of a dick and not think that it's a dick? Danny, how can I look the at head like of it? The balls, it's a dick. Okay, okay. supposed to. It's a dick. So. <sighs> that should it, it, it just I don't know I don't know it's a I don't even sensation. I don't even know what I'm asking it's just why why what is really going on in the world she said penetration sensation, sensation. was that no, okay let me ask you this when you do it to do do you have to go deep in there I mean no you you don't got to so it, it, they hit the crown and both you know you can do it right you can. <laughs> I'm asking where the nerves are at though, like, because apparently this is such a sensational I thing. I mean, 
Yeah, you I mean you gotta kind of. You gotta go in there. You have to get. Oh up hell there. no! She like dick. A little bit. That's dick. You gotta get up. <laughs> See my oh, fucking god, that I I don't know how to say it, like uh, do it because it's like that shit just makes me feel uncomfortable because because I, I'm be honest, with you, one of my homies maybe watching this should be like, fam, I like to get pegged. Now you put me on the spot, you know right. what I'm saying? And, and he don't, I I don't, I'm not saying that he's gay. I don't think that's the thing, the proper thought process. It's just that. What the fuck? It, like, what is it? What is going on right now? You know, if I'm being honest, like, I had someone I did it that I was, like, in, like, a comfortable, healthy relationship, whatever. I just thought it was kind of, like, a mm. weird, you know, little fetish thing. Never thought he was gay. Just thought it was, like, a little, you mm. know, thing. He, like, I wouldn't. That but then, like, thought of thinking gay. being with, like, and then, like, I ran into someone else and, like, they kind of, like, Maybe not to like that far of extent, but I know if I would have brought far it extent, up, that means he was like you were stroking him with him. Like, <laughs> be real, you were stroking him <laughs> down with that because you just said that extent. That means he was taking the whole pipeline. You're putting thumbs in his back. I see you were stroke. Be real, be real. Put you was thumb. long stroking it wasn't you? Bow, bow, this bow, is fucking crazy, bro. I wish I could tell you the story. Fam, give us the story. I'm gonna know the story when we leave. I'm gonna no, leave. fuck that. We gotta get those pies. I tell you, like, I felt like I came home like a drunk nigga because he was at home. I went out with the girl. Yep. Came home on some drunk shit. Okay. Tore him up. <laughs> well, okay. Let me. Damn. <laughs> it was like, when let, I let tell me you, know, was you long stroking it though? Oh, I ain't gonna lie. I was fit the Hennessy stroke. Like the... I was. And was fam was taking it. Too? Was he talking your shit to him? Big, big nigga too. Talk. Yeah, take it was a big dude. Take this shit. Take this. Big, big boy. Tell him take this shit, big nigga. Boy. What was his race? Yeah. Hot <coughs> weekend. He was black. <laughs> he was black. <laughs> oh my god. What is going on, man? He gonna see this video and be bitch. I'm gonna oh, find you. Man. He gonna be bitch. I'm gonna find you. Oh. <laughs> it was. <laughs> Y'all, y'all would be surprised. So you was long stroking the fucking, and he was like, "Give it to me." Smacking his ass and everything. No, no, no. I want to know dead ass. Was dead, like dead ass? You, give it, like, were you dead saying, ass. "Give it to me," or like, what was he saying he to you? He was into like he he was that what? <laughs> it was a great time. It was a oh, great time. That was male. And nobody <laughs> said, "Oh, they call me JT for a reason." How we right? just not <laughs> looked at it? Oh. <laughs> No. I don't even know what I was on on some road shit. Really, like, we had it, like, you know, we were sexually open. You know, we did other stuff. And right. I don't know. I can't hold up that fit the Hennessy. <laughs> I, my mind is so... Anything is possible. Fucking... I don't even Anything. know. The whole thing I'm got so me. absolutely said, confused right is now. Is he black? Is he black? And it killed me. I'm sorry. Fuck. So you was long... See, okay, look. Can, if somebody in the comments, can you please just explain to me? I don't even know what the explanation I'm looking for. I'm so why does confused. it feel good? I mean, I don't no, know. No, 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 no. I understand the why because when I looked at the doctor thing, they said this because it's a they bundle of nerve why. there. Okay. Just like how the woman shit is under that clip, right? It's the right. same thing. Facts. So I understand that part. But why you would allow but it? But I understand us exploring and shit right like that, right? But. But I, I I just feel like that right there is the gateway to going to doing other shit. You think that's how it starts before it starts? I feel like it has to be because if you stroking this nigga like this at, at the, the club or whatever with, with the Henny joint, what if he gets drunk and another dude come up on him and stroke it, he going to be like, fuck it, just take that shit. He I ain't going to have no resistance. So. I ain't going to lie. I think so. I can confidently he say He ain't going to have no he resistance. He was well, okay, he might, but I'm saying if, if it had the same shape as a dildo and, and, and he wasn't and, ready for it, right? And he was like, yo, thinking about you, right? And dude just walk up on him, start smashing. He gonna think it's you! And when he turn around, he gonna be like, damn, nigga, I want you to stop, but damn, that shit feel good. No, no, I think that that's where, I think it was just definitely like an intimate, like, we both comfortable, this feel good. Go crazy, I just, you my uh, bitch, and I love It's you. like when niggas say and doing like, doing coke too. or something like that is a uh, they saying uh, uh, doing a doing a gateway drug, right? I so feel like that's a, a gateway, gateway <laughs> drug, man. Like a gateway. Like you gonna fuck around and it, this it's is where it starts. Where do it stop? We today crack tomorrow. 
Where do it stop? If you getting beamed in the ass, where does it stop? He said beamed. No, I mean, he she said, said she was long stroking it. What? Yo, oh, that's man. crazy he said, to me. Thumbs in the back, the slap is out. What the hell? I'm. Yeah. Fam, I, I ain't so gonna care. <laughs> it was, you know, it was fine. It was so Cause you were, fun. you was, you was like demasculating that nigga, wouldn't you? Well, yeah, I know he just felt all fucked. But that's up what I'm him. saying though. As I know, a dude, yeah. I you know can't be masculine question. when you, you, you gonna get, you getting towed up. It, no, it, right now, I question. It breaks up. Do you get pleasure? Where of course you do. No, 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 no. I'm saying not like what? that. It's, no, no it, it's the emotional. Part imagine of you. like being like Queen of Sheba, like Medusa, like you. This is you, like this okay, man the, is like the, the you. And it's Charlie. not. It's not the feeling body it's wise. Like it's, a, it's the no, mental. It but the, but, but, but the mental. mental. But the mental is what makes a girl wet. It's what makes the a mental, girl wet. Um, the mental. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm back, back here going crazy. crazy. Right it ended right up even happening to me because sex. Regular sex is alright, but the sex that you mentally ready yeah. for, Ooh. different. And that, man. Facts. Man. Facts. Man. Well, what the woman thing is, is all mental. So when you really up in there, I'm just like. Fam, I ain't going to cap. This some wild shit. I, I felt like I might have opened the, the wrong door, looked in, and like, hey, yo, what the fuck? Just because of that. And, and apparently there's tons of, like, low-key, the poppy... The amount of people who get down with this shit is absurd. He ain't never been around our neighborhood where we're from. Mm, weird. So niggas getting pegged over there. He ain't never been around our neighborhood. I feel like you know what? I I I feel stranger, sorry stranger for me even bringing up this situation. <laughs> I, I apologize. I, I apologize. Because I when I'm gonna tell you when you when I was done is when you said you was stroking that nigga with the henny joint. That to me, because I know when you on the henny. It, when you on the Henny, you put like the... It was like superpowers. Yeah. What? You put, like, the, you put the little imp, you know what I mean? Bite the lip, spin the cap, you know what I mean? I had hey. reason, too. It was like a majestic feeling. <sighs> oh, my God. A very majestic. But I was talking about physically. Like, does the strap on feel good when you're using it for you? No, because like it's, right, it's right here, Like man. he said, with mental... It, it's a mental thing. Oh, okay. There's nothing for she feels because it's on her... It's well, right on her pelvic area. My, my cousin, she's... She's lesbian. She. Her, it's a power her, thing. Her strap on has a vibrator. Oh, on you the can you can get them double so sided. You, you, you can turn it on. It vibrates as she's using. Mm. It. Oh, that's you can get them double sided. That's all asking, like, physically stuff. doesn't even feel. Good I see what you're saying now. Yeah. Like you get the like, do you get nasty. do you get sensation out of it? That's what I'm asking. Do you get sensation or get off from it? That's what I'm saying. Damn, this or is it just the power of you? Over it, it's just the power and control I have. I'm a I'm a sick bastard. I'm a sick bastard. I'm I'm gonna be real with y'all. I'm the type of dude where I'm terrified. So I can talk to my homie, I'm like, man, this nigga might get pegged, man. Damn. <laughs> like, like, well, I, I'm scared of letting nigga come for the night. Cause I'm yeah. like, man, this nigga might get pegged, man. <laughs> Damn. Like, Fuck. like, because I, you don't know what, like, man. I told y'all, I, I have a, I had that thing where I was scared. Mm-hmm. I didn't want to wake up, but I got fucked by dude. You know what I'm saying? It was like a, that was like a big trauma of, of being scared of myself. So when I, I so when I got drunk. I would only get drunk with certain people, or I would I would I would stay awake and drive forty five minutes super duper drunk yeah. just so I can sleep at the right person. I ain't gonna lie to you, it's a fear of mine to get taken advantage of. That's why I don't like drinking because you never know what someone slips in your drink. It was just bad it's in the military for sure because the military it was it happened a lot and yeah. you couldn't say nothing about it because if you did, you would look crazy as fuck. Right. In the military, oh yeah, it was, and you get into play with these guys. You got to see him. You going you going to fuck around and get killed out there, you know what I'm saying, by the dude who you snitched on. Mm-hmm. So, you know what I'm saying, but this shit just is a whole nother level of hey, yo, what the fuck is going on? Cuz I I never even would have thought that was a thing, and now t- come to find out niggas getting long stroked off the hand dog. <sighs> I'm gonna show to your crib with the head. No, the fuck you ain't, man. The fuck you ain't, bro. Man, that's crazy. Hold on, one second. Jake, the moment you pop up my house, you gotta go. Hold on, one second. Get her the fuck out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get her the fuck Anytime out. Anytime I see that bottle of Henny now, I'm like, you know what? Just like, I'm like, I know what she doing. So you saying, so who you call? You better ask her, did she do something to I'm gonna call my friend Ryan, who I met on TikTok. I'm gonna ask her if she's ever pegging me.
You've been Hold on, Fekish, because you got to speak louder into the mic, because I, I don't think it's taking out too much of your voice. I'm going to call my friend Raya. Okay. Then see if she's, she's ever pegged a man. Because I feel like if there's anyone that's ever pegged a man, it'll be my girl Raya. Okay. So see, this against the ground. Now, now, now this, this, this is the first random person, person right? Yeah. Okay, thanks. <laughs> hey, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Tell, tell I'm on the podcast right now, so your 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 answer's gonna get recorded, okay? Oh my god. Have you ever pegged a man before? Yes, I have. <laughs> well, wait a minute. <laughs> Explain what pegged is, though. What? Explain what pegged is. Y'all are y'all y'all wilding. Oh my God! Y'all right, just don't, don't 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 be don't be immature about the situation. Just be grown and adult about it. What is pegging? I put on a strap and fuck him in the ass. Oh my God! <laughs> what the fuck is going on? What the fuck is wrong with you two? JT just did the same oh, thing that she's done it too. But, but dude wanted it, right? Like he was begging for it. No, I talked him into it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Like Did you long stroke him? No. Ah. Okay, okay, so, so you, you just went kind of in or you, or you went all the way in? I went all the way in. No! Oh, oh my fucking like God. Like JT said, and JT's over here saying, no, I long stroke him off the Henny bottle. <laughs> what the fuck? Yes, yes. Okay, okay. So, so was that just that one guy or, or has this happened more than a couple times? times? Like with the same guy, it's only happened with one guy. So just one, okay. So you yeah. haven't had it where it was like a couple of different guys. You like, yeah, this is kind of. So JT, you experienced. You said multiple men. Yeah. Oh fuck. Oh. Nah. Man. It's, yeah, I'm a girl, girl. So. Yeah. So right. only one guy. Right. Go ahead and count that one off your checklist on that one. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> what do you mean shit? What do you mean? Hang on, now you that was getting juicy. What do you mean shit? <laughs> shit in the word. Count that, that one off your list when it comes to me. <laughs> I'm glad you bring up his name because if he were to see this episode, holy shit. Oh man. Uh, all right, all right, I'll get a hold of you later. I appreciate you. No problem. All right, later. Oh, what the fuck? Damn. <laughs> So this is legitimately a, a situation, yes. like a, a maybe even a normal thing. Mm-hmm. Dude, I can I can make one more call, girl. I, I bet, bet you do it. I bet you it's happening in seventy percent households. Okay. This Wait, is, what? This is the second person I'm calling. No, 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 pause that. What number? What percent did you say? Seventy. Fam, you got. Maybe it. not like on an everyday basis. But it's happening. But, but like months. it's it's happening. Like yes, it's happening at least. I'm gonna call right now. Seventy percent. So I I I would put money. Go ahead. Yeah. I'm gonna call it. right now. What the I'm fuck? Call. Okay. Hopefully she answers. Mm. Man. Hello. Hey, you busy? Can you hear me? What? Like children I know. Back. I'm gonna I'm call. I'm gonna try one more time. Ask her. Yeah, ask her if she's busy. Cause she says she's busy. Then you can't have her ask me a question like that in front of the kids. Oh no. I get one more ring. She probably didn't realize it was you. Probably. Uh, go ahead. I'll call you that one. If she calls back, I'll ask her. If she calls back. <laughs> Damn. It's Damn. definitely a, a natural thing. Yep. Damn. Fam, I, Just embrace it, guys. And, and I'll be honest, I'm not judging Did you say somebody it? for it. I'm talking it. shit. Oh, I'm not judging somebody for it. It's just more of a... You mean to tell me, like, some of my homies is getting beat down? Facts. I don't not know. all of them. No, I know. I'm just, and not I said, on a daily basis. Some. And not no, on a daily basis. To me, if it happened once, it happened. But, well, I, but here's the thing, fun. here's the thing. I can see where she's coming from because don't don't look over here at me. Don't even fucking sit here and judge. And it'll be like, Rick, what you mean? I can see where she's coming from, though, when she sat there and said that some men just get comfortable around their, their mm-hmm. partner. And they're they're and they're open to experience shit like that with their partner because they're close to them. Right. And like, they're, they're just comfortable. Hey, I feel like I can talk to you about this. Mm-hmm. I can do this with you. I want to try it out. Like, okay. Yeah, they ain't going to do it with a random girl bitch. Said it. Right, yeah. Uh, now, look. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, 
Because I'm about to be like, look, like, I got a fat ass, right? No homo. <laughs> I got so yams, you know what I'm saying? You so, I got yams. So, like, my, my, <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I remember, I remember my girl saying one time as a joke, like, man, I, man, I, man, I'm, you, you better be glad you ain't gay, cause niggas will tear your shit up. And we, you know, we all we be talking shit to each other, but right, thick. <laughs> ah, yo, relax. Ag said thick. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> but like, uh, man, I, I don't know, man. I, I, I can't get out of my head to where it's like, yo, if the, if the world, if the end of the world came. You'd be the easiest nigga to switch it up. But <laughs> You'd be the easiest nigga to switch but it up. But, like, okay, not that not that in specific, but, you know, being in love with your wife or something like that, if there's something, like I said, not that, but something that maybe, like, she wanted to do or something like that because you love her and you're comfortable with her, would you do it because she wanted to do it? Something. Okay, okay. I, I, I will say, so, my girl, she likes tall salad, right? Mm-hmm. So... She'll do it all the time, every now and then. You know what I'm saying? Like, maybe like once every blue moon. Wait, what? Tall salad. You know what tall salad is? Wait, what? <laughs> so she likes to eat the butt, basically. Who do? My girl. <laughs> now, she... have you seen that TikTok video? No, I wasn't me, expecting it. that. Like, you caught me off guard. Wait, wait, I wasn't expecting that. Well, no, because she, she, said, she said, is there things that you would do that you normally would do, but because you're with your... First that you love, you you know, you're more comfortable right. blah, blah, blah. So that that's as far as I I have taken it. <laughs> and and even then I felt like Don't laugh at me. I, 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 I liked it, but I feel like a little bitch when she <laughs> That's what's making me laugh and the way you're I'm, I, I, hey, can you see how my soft my voice got? I'm like, hey look man. But I'm look, thinking, guys, I'm, I'm, don't I'm, judge I'm, me. I'm thinking the more how much more of a bitch would you feel like if you get stroked? <laughs> Damn, because you gotta understand something. I know when I when I nut right, I'm like, oh, I, I, I'm gone, right? <laughs> so you trying to tell me there, there's a bundle of nerves in the butt cavity where it they say it's the best orgasm you've ever had in your life. Like it, it needs not, buckle in. Yes, they said it's the best. You, you can't compete with it because that's all, all your nerves are at. So I'm like, I'm gonna feel like a baby back bitch if I <laughs> if, if that happens. Like, no. She's sitting there stroking you all of a sudden. You ah. Oh. Nah, it's, you gonna have a, a more high pitch. It, it's, it's, it's gonna be. Oh. You gonna be laying there vulnerable. Like on naked and afraid. Get in a position. Like you want a, you want a cigarette. You want a cigarette. In better? fetal position. I'm uh, staying over there. You need a cup of water. <sighs> me, me personally, I want to. I want to. I want to get. I want to transition off this subject. I'm gonna be real. This shit is crazy. This shit is wild to me. Seventy percent. I'm so glad I'm not thirty. Wait, wait. Say, hey, look in the camera. I want you to say that statement that you just said. I bet you, and at least. At least seventy percent homes that there are people that are getting pegged. Not on the daily, but maybe birthdays, Hennessy nights. I'm that thirty percent. This is crazy. As of man. now, he is. I'm that. Hey, here we go. As of now, now, now is crazy. <laughs> the way he just <laughs> like he's gonna get that <laughs> ass touched. Like I'm bringing Hennessy tonight. Well, okay, 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 hold on, hold on. I will say this though. I will say this. When you with the right chick though. She do make a nigga feel a certain way. Cause I remember I never I never had eaten ass before, right? But this one chick I was dating, I had fell stupidly in love with her and she loved it, right? He was and so I'll be in there and I'll be turning at it. And I didn't even it, it was cause I loved it so much, I never second guessed it. So maybe if you know if if that if that that maybe could have been the situation realistically because I was so so in love that I was I was drunk off of it. I I, I loved having Watching her. her be happy. I loved it. It was like a drug. Her so ass, I right? could see from that perspective when she said she talked when she just said she talked dude into it. I can see if dude was in love with her so That's... much that that could have been a thing. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying I. I feel like if I let my girl do that, where does it stop? Like, do my homeboy come over and he get hurt? Like, I, I feel like that shit is what you can't, you can't go there with that shit. He said, where does it stop? For real, where is it? Because you literally have to dick in your ass. 
What is the difference between a, 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 a dildo and a fake dick? Hey, he, he's not getting off the whole dick in the ass part. That's it, is that is the dick in there, fam? Like, I mentally, I don't care what you're doing or it feels good, whatever. I'm mentally like, nigga, that's a dick in my ass. I ain't no way I can get, I can't get past that. That is a... <laughs> and then you, and then dude let you long stroke him. Oh, that's crazy to me, buddy. He, he let you legitimately Every long stroke Every time you say it, I get a flashback. 